Hello, everybody. Welcome to Keen. This is a game I saw. It. It's in its pre-alpha build, as you can see from the thing in the upper right-hand corner. Uh, first, I was attracted to the name because I'm a big Commander Keen fan, and then I looked at it and I said, huh, this looks like it could be interesting. I don't know if I'm going to be able to handle the controls very well. It definitely looks like a game that's meant for someone who actually has a gamepad, and I've just got a keyboard and mouse. So I don't know if I'm even going to be able to play this. But let's find out, because so far it looks and sounds amazing. Uh, this is just a demo, of course. It won't be a full game. Fencing with Shadows. Grandma took me and my new sword to her dojo, where she taught me stuff I already knew. <laughs> Okay, uh, finish stage, move limit, 150 moves, all elements, collect all elements. Okay, so it looks like I've got to uh, do special things to get stars, I guess? That's a, something for completionists to look forward to. Don't make me go and grab that blade for you, Kim. We have a lot to practice in so little time. Go. Oh. Alright, let's... Huh. Oh, okay, so it's, it's a maze. Ha. Ah. Oh, okay, alright. Uh, I don't know how obvious that was from what you saw, but it looked a lot like I... That when I move in a direction... I go to the end of whatever line I'm in, I think, anyway. So it's a grid-based thing. Let's see here. Can I... Oh, wait, did I restart? Oh, okay. The alternate... The alternate... Mouse, uh, the the alternate fire button makes you uh, restart. Don't make me go and grab that blade for you, Kim. We have lots of practice, so little time. Go. Let's see if I can do this faster than before. Okay. I am ready for Grandma's training camp. I guess my name is Kim. Now, I move up. I waste a move. Uh, oh, okay. Slash, slash, slash. So that just run through things. Okay, I get it. Spare the training dummies, Grandma. I've been carrying weapons around since I was three. But not a magical mystery blade like this little beauty. Now go train some more. Grandma, Grandma's really just looking out for us. Okay, let me look at this. Uh... I guess I'm going to stop at that cushion, so... Bam, 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 bam. Okay, easy enough so far. Standard tutorial thing. Oh. Uh, courses, baking cookies, cross-stitching, home farming, deadly karate, <laughs> and roll now. Okay, uh, uh... Is there a way to do any of these without backtracking? Okay, all right, I've got to end at the X. My first move has to be up one, and my next move has to be continuing. Oh, okay, so if I land between two things, I destroy them. Okay, I thought I was gonna have to hit each and every one. Okay, I think I'm getting the hang of this. Maybe, huh, I guess I have to go up. And I stop at the barrel. Okay. Stopping at the barrel is... Huh. Interesting. Okay, so if I understand the math correctly, I'm going to dart across to the right, and then I... When I hit... I don't know if you can see my mouse. When I hit that one, one farthest to my right there, will it destroy the two next to me? Do I destroy things in a 3x3 three three grid? Okay, right, because I stopped before it. 
So it looks like I destroy everything around me. Bam. Bam. Oh no, no. This is suboptimal. Uh, that almost looks like if I went to the left, there might be like another path, but I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna kill myself looking for secrets just yet. What have you got in store for me in this room, Grandma? Okay, so this is a different type of barrel now. We've got springs. Are they gonna shoot me back? I have to go up. They move. They move. They move. Okay. Alright, they move when I move, if they have springs. Good to know. Okay. Uh... I actually have choices this time. Uh, hmm. Bam. Bam. And they always move towards me. So. Bam. 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 Okay. There was a better way to do that, I think. Are you everywhere, Grandma? I'm pretty fast for my age. Just checking if you got the main attacks right. There's a slashing attack when you move through an enemy, and a stomping attack if you stop adjacent to the enemy. I got it. Slashing deals twice the damage, but I need room to move straight past the enemy. Stomping attacks in a cross-shaped pattern. Can we stop now? I'm starting to sweat. Okay, so... Okay, so... Running through something deals more damage, but stomping... Interesting. There's a lot to take in. Um... Bam. 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 I'm sure there was a better way to do that. Okay, oh! Grandma's farm. Aha. 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 Ooh, what's that? Why? What does why mean? Okay, um, hang on a second. I'm at 91 of 115 moves. Okay, I don't know what why means, but wait. You were fired. Okay. What do we got? And these are more of the basic ones, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bam, bam, bam. Victory! Finish stage and move limit! I did the move limit. Collect all elements. I don't know what that means, but maybe on a later playthrough. I like this. I like this. Okay, I got two stars. What's next? Uh, can't quite see the whole screen there. Benevolent Arson. Convinced of my ninja-like abilities, Grandma ordered me to burn the bridge. Finish stage. Move limit. Don't die. Finish with dying once. It probably means don't without dying once. I'm not sure why it's cut off slightly there, but we'll see where this goes. The corrupts are approaching our isle pretty fast. If you get to the bridge before they do, you can burn it down and shield the village. And what if they're already there? I don't want to fight them, Ma. We've got no other option. Burn the bridge and come back home. Go! Well, I, I guess I'll go then. 
Uh, there's a lock on that door. Uh-huh. Key required, you say. Ah. Okay, well that's a puzzler. Um... That was easier than I thought. Oh. Okay. Huh. I can I can figure this out. Maybe. This is There we go. Okay. I'm smart. I can make with the smarts. Zombie. Great. Oh no. It's vegetarian zombies. <laughs> is that is that a real life comics reference? They might have come up with it on their own. Stand of our rice fields, undead scum. Let me show you a thing or two. Okay. Slam? Slam? Oh, you're not finished off. Okay. Huh. No? Not done, not done yet? Aha! Well, I'm fighting zombies now. I really like this. <laughs> she's got the little third eye, because she's telepathic, apparently. Remember, Kim, enemies attack when they move to a position adjacent to you. Avoid standing on risky places, and you'll be just fine. Ah, get off my head, Grandma! Hmm. So enemies attack when they're adjacent to you? Bam. Bam. Okay. And... Huh. Bam. Ow. Okay. Grandma wasn't wrong. I took damage there. Okay. Can I run over the tiny grass things? I guess not. Ooh, a bonus heart. Yeah. Ha! Ah. And ha! Ah. There, my hearts are better. Oh, come on. Really? Um... No! Ah, stop that! Stop it, you! I am not the best at this. Ooh, okay. Time to... Time to regroup. Time to change tactics a bit. No! Okay! Defeat. I'm gonna retry this room here. I guess that heart was a safe space, too. Uh, slash... Slash... Ow. Ow. No. Ow. Okay, so if you hit them, I guess they don't attack. Attack. Bam. 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 No. Ah! I am bad at this. I was good at this game until there was actual challenge involved. Aha. Aha. Okay, so if I zip across to the right, will that guy attack me because I'm over him? Is that a dangerous place? Let's find out. Yes, over is danger. Okay. Ah. Uh, I did not like that. Zip, zip. Zip, zip. And zip, zip. Zip, zip. Zip, zip. I am not going to get the move challenge reward boost. Whatever. No. I was trying to avoid that, but oh well. <sighs> Maybe I can ignite these haystacks and burn the bridge. Maybe. That's a good idea. Uh, just, do I just run through them then? Alright, these are conveniently stacked. Oh. 
maybe not so convenient. There we go. Okay. I got it. Uh, this is going to be tricky. All right. If I hit them, they won't hit back. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. Uh. No, okay. So they have to already be at the adjacent point for it to actually work. Victory, finish stage. Move limit, did I get move limit? I did not, and finish without dying once. You know, I bet I can do that if I go back. Benevolent Arson, what is stage three? Forest of Illusion. I got carried away at the bridge and felt I could get rid of all evil before swimming back home for dinner. Finish, take no damage, and kill every enemy, I'm guessing? Okay. So finish, one for finishing the stage, one for no, I think, no damage, and one for killing every enemy. Uh, let's see how the Forest of Illusion works. Not that tough after all. Grandma will be so proud when I find out where they were coming from. I guess she wouldn't mind waiting for me a little longer. Go! Ah, uh, some sort of force field blocking that door. Beware. And this way? Those signs appear to be... Uh... Not quite in line with each other. At least this level I don't have a turn limit. Forest of Illusion! Use a map! Whoa. Well, I probably should use a map. My Zork senses are telling me... Eh? What is that? How do I get that? Huh. No, I didn't want to restart. Okay. That was my mistake. At least restarting is nice and easy. Okay. Um, I wanted to try to figure out a way to... get to that triangle there, but I don't see an immediately obvious way. Okay, well, I'm gonna think about that. I'm gonna mull that over. Zombie time! Okay, I think I can take out this first group without any problems, and then this group without any problems. Then I'll go here and take him out. Then I'll squash again. This room requires me to... Okay, now I see why they said use a map. That would be convenient. You know, I bet I could use the zombies to help me traverse maps. Alright, let's go this way for now. Ah. Go up there, and there, and there. Go this way. Same basic room, okay. If I just attack that guy, I'm gonna take damage. So go up first, then down, then this way, then this way. Okay. No damage yet so far. That second star is practically mine. Um, ninjas go left. Oh, there we go. Okay. Zip. This is a infuriatingly blank canvas of a room. What have I done? Aha, 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 aha. I'm starting to put some pieces together here, I think. I'm starting to get a sense for 
how everything's connected. And now if I go back this way... Now, there still really isn't any good way to get over there, is there? Let me think. I, I think I have to come in from the that other as-yet-unknown entrance to do that. So let's see what I can figure out. Uh-huh. I'm glad I picked this game up. This is fun. By the way, this game is... Oh, boy. This is... Huh. Let me look at this. Okay, well, if I go left, I'm going to get attacked. Or maybe I won't, because I will attack the guy there. Same with going up. I wonder if I get attacked if I do a do the cross attack right here. Huh. Let's... Find out. Okay, that guy's taking some damage. Um, if I go up, then I'm still safe. Okay, I'll go up. But now, dang it, I think no matter which way I go, the zombies will move and attack me. Unless when I go left, if I can, like, stun them, that might... Okay, okay. Got some breathing room. Uh, not as much as I'd like, though. If I go up, I get... I get attacked. Unless I stun him. Let me try that. Yeah, okay. I got this. I think I can figure this out. Um... Down. Oh, okay. That didn't work the way I wanted it to. Dang it, I was so sure. I was so sure I was just going to slice right through him. Because right? it was like a square under him, so I thought there would be space to move beyond him, but I guess not. Um, I, I'm going to take damage. There's just no way not to. Yeah. So I'll go down there. Dang it, stop that. Okay, well that was painful and kind of sad. And... But, we are rewarded for our patience with that passage. Chikara Brainwashing and Robots Incorporated. That's a bad sign. Well, I finished the stage at least. Okay, Chikara Brainwashing. Force of Illusion, complete the wrath of the Cyber Lich. That stinky metal house in the middle of the forest could be harboring monsters, or corrupts, as Grandma calls them. Okay, so finish, finish the level, I guess. Kill and eh? no enemies but survive, I'm guessing. Oh, and it's timed. Finish in a minute, and a minute and a half, I guess. Hmm. That last one might be a little tricky. What do we got? Taking a while to load this one. Go! Okay. Let's right, see, I got a potted plant that could give me some problems. Um, also got a timeline, don't I? Um, yeah. And then attack like that. And then attack like that. Was that so tough? Okay, if I go down, he he hurts me, and I don't want that. Uh-huh. 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 Dead. Alright. Huh. There's a key there. Key required. How do I... 
I love this music, by the way. Ah, ah. Was I? Oh, okay then. I, I'm dumb. Uh, select to open mini map. Which button select? Mouse three, maybe? No. I have no idea what select is. M. Uh, that's probably not important. Okay, this mini-map instruction thing is just going to stick around, isn't it? Okay... I can't see... Oh, so I have to come in from that other elevator to get that green emerald thing. Okay, I don't need the mini-map yet. Okay, this is a, uh, this is bugging me. Where can I? There's no controls thing. So slash slash slash. Let's see if the key is up here. I don't want a mini map. If I hit enter. I hit enter just as that. Enter. What other button might be enter? E R. No, don't restart. Okay. Aha. 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 There. Okay. I have no idea how to make this mini map control thing go away. Where are we going this way? Oh, zomb zombies. Zombies. Yep. And yeah. And we'll go that way. That way. No. Well, I tried. And hey, I can get that emerald thing now. I don't want the mini-map! Good. Gemstone. What's good about a gemstone? Oh, the key, right. I wanted a key. I needed the right sequence? I need to go three? Okay, yeah, I need to sequence this. So, one, and then I can't hit that one. Okay, followed by that. Yeah! Got a feeling there's something behind those boxes. No time to figure it out now. Oh good, the boss chamber. Hopefully the boss chamber will tell me to stop looking for a mini-map. Not yet, I don't. Um, I want to get that. I don't know how. I feel like there's a way. I just... There's a way to do this. I'm just not thinking about things correctly. Well, maybe there's a way to do it. Maybe something needs to change. Okay, boss room, don't fail me now. I don't, okay, good, but the mini-map didn't wait. Hello, you tiny intruder. That was impressive. Not only have you found this hidden facility, you also managed to break into my office, and we're one room away from deactivating the whole complex. Too bad you're just a snotty little girl while I'm the teleporting robot demon boss that can lay landmines. Good luck with that toy sword, kiddo. Ah, uh, I still have to open the mini-map. Why? Are those pictures of the programmers? I bet those are pictures of the programmers. Okay, so to the programmers in the upper left and upper right corner, I want to say this is one of the most fun games I've played in a while. 
I have no idea how to open the mini-map, so that I don't know how to make that go away. Uh, let's go... I don't think I should attack him, because then I'll just be attacked by the robots. I'll go here, 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 and then here, then up here. Over here? No, nope. no, nope. attacked by a robot. As we always knew I would be. Okay, that was on purpose, believe it or not, because I wanted to do that. That would be one of the landmines. Aha. Uh -huh. No, I can't very well go up, left, or right. If I... And if I try moving left or down, it doesn't, like, stall or anything, so... Uh, hopefully he only does one damage. Ooh. Okay. And hopefully... I guess I have to hope he only does one damage again. Yeah, he only does one damage. Okay, good. Slash through. And down here, slash through. Uh, huh, okay, I think I... Did one of those landmines go away? Does he only have, like, four landmines? Um, ah, I can't hit a landmine. Oh, they're timed. They're timed, guys! Yeah! One room away from destroying the complex, he said. I wonder if... Hang on. Uh, okay, I want to see. If I run right, will I hit the golf ball? No, I won't. Okay. It's worth a shot. Let's turn off this horrible facility. Kickstarter. Keen needs you. We hope you're enjoying Keen. Back us up on Kickstarter to help develop the full version of this game at katnigiri.com slash keen. Well, you know what, guys? You know what, you devs? You shamelessly plugging devs? I actually did really enjoy this. Um, I'm poor, personally, so I don't think I'm going to be able to back it myself. But, you know, maybe some of my viewers would be interested in supporting this. Um, maybe they would be, maybe they would. I don't know. I personally want to see this game come to life. I, I'm getting, like, it's like a weird Invader Zim meets, like, Invader Zim meets, um, oh, what, what, what's the name of that one thing? Invader Zim meets Legend of Zelda. Kill everybody. No, no enemy alive. I didn't make the time limit, sadly. But that's the end of the Keen demo. I still don't know why it's called Keen. Um, oh, and it took that gem. Is that one of the elements? Like, if I went back to the first level, are there elements? Anyway, uh, I'm going to put a link to this game in the description if you want to play it yourself. And I really recommend that. It's a lot of fun. Uh, and if you want to support it on Kickstarter, you just saw the link there. Um... But this is, uh, this was a lot of fun. I'm glad I gave this game a shot. Thanks for watching this video, and I'll see you next time I'm up to something game-related. Bye, everybody.